Well, right now, I'm delighted to say we can welcome into our studio Sophia Zook, who's just won the Junior Girls Championship here at Wimbledon. Many congratulations. Thank You're out you. there on court one. Just tell us how it feels to have your name on that trophy that's going to be in that cabinet forevermore. Yeah, it's really excited because it's my first Wimbledon and I had a first slam at Roland Gross. But I'm just in love with the like uh, feelings here when you come in the court. But today, the first time I were playing on this big court, so we're like really emotional, and it's really helps me a lot with the. Um... Oh yeah, oh, yeah <laughs> it's yeah. me. Uh, do, do you not watch yourself play tennis often? No. No. So describe for us this moment right here. It were like yeah because I had on the end of the second set I had a really, a really so much cramps on a, on a calf so we're understanding if you can make a maximum what you can you just put all your power in that and you just yeah if you're winning in two sets yes it's good but because I understand it that if I lose the second set the third set I just don't have any power to play so when I when the match point was like I were like uh, yes it's finished yes <laughs> absolute joy and uh, relief as well so were you nervous this morning when you woke up no I were like really excited to go in the court faster because I really wanted to join this court number one it was I was watching Maria in the court one when she was playing with Zarina Diaz so I were like thinking what emotions that they have when it, when they're playing on this big court. And I really didn't know that so much people are going to watch juniors because yeah. normally they, I, I was thinking that everyone's going to go to the Wimbledon ladies final. So when I just came out to the court and so, oh my God, it's so much people. And I was really happy because I'm just in love to play when there's so much people. Yeah. Was that the biggest crowd you've ever played yeah. in front of? Really? Yeah, really. Was it? And you managed to produce your best tennis. Yeah, because it really helps. It helps. Yeah, because I really love to play when it's a lot of people. Hey everybody, even though so Anna Blinkova is your friend. Yeah. Did she was she helped by it too? Did you feel? Did she? Uh, but she gave the interview before and she says that it's she were feeling a little bit not comfortable because she's playing also the first time on a big court and she said that she didn't feel good the um, like uh, place on the court because it's like really big stadium. I was like, okay, no problem. <laughs> <laughs> I feel my best and it's really good, so I was happy. So you said it's your first Wimbledon here. Has it lived up to all your expectations? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah, but actually I was looking only by TV, so I didn't know how the place here in like some little courts, but it was like, actually I was thought that on, by the TV, it's not the same, like in life it's much better. It's, lo uh, it's like much beautiful that it's how it is. So, yeah, yeah go ahead. No, I was gonna say, where do you play your, most of your tennis? Because obviously there's a little bit of an accent American accent, yeah. I think. So where do you where do you play your tennis? Belgium and Russia. In <laughs> Belgium and, Ru yeah. and Russia. Ah. Okay. And your English, you've learned the English from where? Actually, from, from, school, from eight. Uh, no, actually, from eight years old. It's Sunday in the morning at seven o'clock okay. uh, during one year. <laughs> I go to the teacher with my mom. It's the <laughs> famous teacher. Like she had no time because she were in university, so she had only time in the morning at seven o'clock. So it was each time with my mom, please not this day. So she a little bit helped me with the accent, but after I have like practicing in different countries, so I have an American accent by myself. I don't know yeah. why. Well, she did a good job because now she knows that you can do uh, uh, interviews in English for yeah. the rest of your career. That's Actually, I speak more beautiful in English than in Russian. <laughs> <laughs> it's more easy to give interviews. In so English. you go to Belgium as well, you said. You yeah. Said, okay. So, so uh, can you can you explain a little bit of your of your what your year looks like? You go to Belgium for how long, and then you go back to Russia. Yeah, we're mixing because my mom have a touristic European visa. It's like 90 days per one year. And I have like a study card that you can be there one, how much you want, mm, like okay. per year. And they're changing all the time. So we try to mix between the tournaments because I practice in Belgium, like technically with yes. my coach. And it's really helped because uh, he's really saying that it's important. During What's his name? Olivier Genome. She oh. was with Irina Hromacheva. Oh, OK. When she was in the final here. Oh, OK. So he were wa working on it a lot, on the technical part and some like things like this. So we are mixing between because my home is in Moscow and it's cool. So we try to mix between. Wow, well, that's a good idea. cultured life you're living already. And what's the best bit about all the travel? Because you're already traveling and you're only what 16 years of age? 15. 15. My goodness, you're younger than we thought you were. Yeah. Wow. So you've been traveling a lot. So what's the best bit about the, the life that you're living at the moment? Actually, now I cannot think about the other life. Uh, like just like a normal 
people are leaving school, home, like France, because I even cannot imagine this because I think it's, it's so boring. Because now you're traveling like on all the countries, you're seeing the best players, you're playing on big courts. Mm. I'm just in love with it. It's so interesting. So I yeah. even cannot imagine what I do without tennis. Yeah. You can. I'm, 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 I have to stop this a little bit because she won Junior Wimbledon. Too. Yeah, I did. Yes, many years ago. You oh, weren't even thought God. about then. In 1984, <laughs> she won Wimbledon. Yeah, yes, it is ago. a very long time ago. <laughs> but. Uh, can you, can you see yourself? Uh, a little bit. I mean, bit. how yes, excited is that? It's really can exciting. you imagine being, 80, being that young again? I know, again? that young. It's amazing. Yes, it's exciting. Yeah, like I said, exactly. you have your name on that trophy forevermore in the, in the trophy cabinet, which is fantastic. Yeah. Yes. That's cool. I want to see that. But so yeah. what happens now, you think? You're going to turn, you're going to turn pro at some point and start playing the women's tournament? Um, no, I, will, I think I will mix because uh, still I need to grow up mm -hmm. because uh, to prepare my body because when you go into pro it's a lot of more pressure mm -hmm. on your body yes so I think first I need to grow up because I'm still growing to prepare all the bones and all the muscles for the mm -hmm. uh, for the body mm -hmm. like it, it should more work when you come to the pro so I think I'll mix and I'll begin to play some pros in September because my I won my first 10,000 right. in October last year Wow. And I had played one more tournament, 10,000, in uh, February. I did semi-final. And after that, I didn't play like pros. I, I want to control in juniors. So now I think I will mix a little bit. OK. Nice. Finally, how are you going to celebrate tonight? <laughs> 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 it's actually, I was thinking about that all the time when I, after the final. Not I, on the court. You were no, only thinking no, no, about no, it. No, not on the court, because <laughs> I really need to focus on my game. But uh, I think when I will come to Moscow, I'm, uh, first any uh, like uh, there is going to be the ball here yeah, tomorrow in the uh, in the evening. Okay. So I'm really excited. And to And you go have to there. bring mom to that. Of course, of course, okay. of course. Of course. Uh -huh. But is there a point tonight when maybe you try and drop mom off? No. And go and see no. 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 Okay. No. Good, good. Well, Keep her in mind. Fantastic. It's been an absolute pleasure interviewing you, and uh, we really wish you the very best of luck in the future. I'm sure that we will be interviewing you many yes. times in the future. Yeah. Have a I'm lovely sure evening and enjoy the moment. Yeah. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you so much. Congratulations.